everybody. In this video, we will deal with a very Shakespearean question. Draw, draw right or not draw, draw right. That is the question. Let's detail this question, in fact. In a first example of a previous video, the my view example, I use the method draw or draw right in objective C in the design of the view. And in the Eurotet example, I did no use of this primitive. So let's play a bit with these two approaches. So uh, I reprogram uh, the view controller uh, of the my view example. Here I just do it in the suite version, but I can do exactly the same with the Objective C version. Um, I have a view did load. I create an object of class my view. I handle the view will transition to size and more or less nothing changes here. Okay. Uh, here I have uh, all my uh, elements, okay, the divide, the screen, uh, uh, the labels, and once again nothing changes here. This is the uh, unused uh, init with coder. And here I do the init, okay, and here I do the draw in format. And in the draw in format, I set up the uh, labels, I update the orientation, I set up uh, the frames of the various labels, and I draw circles. And you remember all this code was in the previous version of my example located in the draw rect method. Okay? Let's have a look on how it appears. And you see, you are surprised that the uh, label part is operational, but not the drawing in uh, core graphics. In fact, if you look at the logs, you get an error message. And the message globally states that it's not happy because of a context problem. Okay? Uh, CG context means that the core graphic context is inappropriate. And uh, in fact, uh, if I encapsulate my code in between UI graphics begin image context and UI graphics end image context, I got no more of these messages, but I don't get uh, the circles displayed either. So it's not satisfactory. And in fact, the way to do it, okay, is uh, to create an image view in which you have all these drawing set up and to add this image view as a sub view in your uh, main view. You have to be careful because of course you don't have to recreate this image view every time, you just create it once and then after you just have to move it. Okay? But there is another way. Okay, you can have the label handled as I did in the example that handles rotation and you can also have uh, the uh, image handled in draw draw rect. So here the view controller doesn't change at all, okay, you still have the view did load, you still have the view will transition to size, so this is the uh, you rotate way to handle things. And in my view, uh, so I still have the initialization, etc. I don't uh, go again uh, over this part. And I have the init, and the init just handles the labels and sets the values of the label that will not change according to the uh, device orientation. Okay? And then I also have draw, and in draw, I just build my circles. Okay? And then I have draw in format, where in draw in format I just change the uh, value of the labels that may change according to the orientation. And here I just set up the frames. Now let's have a look on how it looks. And you see that everything is okay. So the uh, draw uh, draw rect uh, part is designed, so just with the core graphic stuff, and the label part is uh, displayed 
uh, in uh, the uh, init. But uh, you can observe that if I split my screen between two applications, then I have this. This is funny because you see the label part is still centered, but the, 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 the circles are not anymore circles, which is a bit annoying, okay? And it's even worse here and even worse here, okay? So you have a part that is still appropriate and the other one that is just squeezed. But in fact, it was predictable. In a previous video, I did a small application, both in Objective-C and in Swift, and I just re-execute here the Objective-C version and everything was in draw or draw right for Objective-C. And a test I did do in this video on purpose at that time is this one. And you see here that, oh, 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 there is a big trouble. Now, I have both the, the, the circles that are squeezed and the labels that are not centered anymore. And if I go here, it's even worse because my labels, I cannot see them because they are elsewhere in the view. And in fact, if I do the 50-50 sharing, uh, you see that they were first centered. It's funny because if I do the change of rotation, then it works, okay, until I change the uh, division of the screen. Okay, let's analyze this. So, as a conclusion, draw and draw right, it's useful if you use core graphic only, but it's dangerous because, uh, in fact, you may create a view that is just an image by using core graphic, and it's better to embed this view as a subview of an already existing view. Okay? My personal opinion is, if you want a view that only has graphics or mainly graphics that you do with core graphics on a small device only, then it's not a problem because draw draw right is sufficient because it supports the change of orientation, but it doesn't support a full resizing of uh, the view that you can have in a large device. Okay. So you can do it. Otherwise, you must consider it's deprecated. And in fact, you must consider that it's more or less deprecated and that you have just its use in a very dedicated situation. And if you do core graphics, then do it in a subview that you will attach to a super view that will handle all the uh, orientation stuff or resizing stuff in fact and then it will work both on small and large devices. So let's forget draw draw right I just show it to you it's historically important but it's not of real use so far to my advice. Thank you very much for your attention see you later.